Okay, so everyone, we're now here in our next video in statistics. And what I'm going to do today is to introduce you to a, another um, very um, good application when it comes to um, doing your statistical analysis in a software. So this application here is what they call Jamovi. Jamovi. So uh, here. So this is Jamovi um, spelled as J-A-M-O-V-I. So um, this one is, um, this, this is it. So this is a Jamovi project by Jamovi. Um, this is a computer software um, using the language and environment of R. So um, we're going to make use of this, okay, in our, in our um, applications. And we're going to check and do cross-check it with our Excel file that we have done um, a while ago. Okay, so first, if you, have even, if you don't have Jamovi yet, since this is a one one application that you need to download in the internet, so you go to Google um, and you try to go to Jamovi um, here, Jamovi.org. Um, what you will end up with is this website by Jamovi. Okay, so um, you can read that on your own. And what in particular what you want to do is click this download tab here, and it will direct you the the, the website itself will determine your OS and for now I am I'm using the Mac OS so what I did is just I just downloaded the solid version instead of the latest one so um, I downloaded this and that's why now I have this Jamovi application here um, alongside with my Excel okay so in a default view what you will see here is that you have three variables um, for now we'll delete the two because we don't have um, we don't have three variables we only have one variable uh, let's call that variable a okay so this is our jamovi default um, i have downloaded some or updated some of my modules so you can see some additional parts here but they are these three are not part of the original um, um software you can you may add them here so if you want you can try to click and um click the jamovi library and you may always add whatever you want um add-ups or add-ins that you want to to install so i have installed some and i will be trying them all out okay so these are the installs what you really want is that the jmv must be there the analysis bundled with jamovi this is the default one so if i'm going to hide everything it will look like the default but let's not do that okay so what i'm going to do today is um we're going to likewise do or apply here um, what we have done in Excel and then let's see um, which one makes it faster okay so what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a data from the Excel so since we only have one um, one variable let's put that under one column let's put them here in A let's continue that copy this one okay going to 11 to 20 and we have a uh, 21 to 30 and then we have uh, 31 to 40 oops sorry not right okay and then we have 41 to 50 okay so these are all our data 50 of them all so what we're going to do is we'll try to create a frequency distribution and notice remember our frequency distribution and how we created this we use the count function and how to do this step by step so you can see count if function you can see it here um, yes here it is so now in Jamovi we'll do this with ease we will do this with ease so what we're going to do is this is the, the default data Okay, anyways, if you have another type of data that you have there, you can always click this column header and you can always change the name of the data. Let's call this um, soft. Okay, it's nominal. Okay, a data type, um, this is automatic. Okay, missing values and then we have the levels here that we have or categories, shall we say? Categories, but we, it's called levels here. And then that's it for the for the data form let's click the analysis this time and what we want to analyze is we're going to try with the exploration part and you may want to check or click the descriptives and here in the descriptives 
how will you be given this part okay in the descriptives um let us hide that the data okay and what we want is to use this variable soft drink brand i'm going to click this here and it will give me these variables and you will see that um, what is happening here is the the descriptives is showing up okay and in particular what we would really want to get is the frequency distribution so what we want to do is to click or put a check mark here in the frequency tables and you will it will give us the frequency distribution itself loading so here we go now what what is the good thing here in Jamovi? Um, the good thing here and the best for me is that it shows already it shows it already in APE format. Okay, so as you can see, this is already in the APE format. We have the counts, we have the percent, we have the cumulative frequency or cumulative percent. So you can see it this is very similar with the Excel format that we did. Only that it's you know it's it's in the it's in our it's it's just one click away in creating in such okay so we may also edit what we want to get here so for instance if you're going to click sat uh, statistics there's a lot of op options there as you can see so we can see the mean the median there's there's no mean and median because this is you know this is nominal data so we may as well delete that in the tick marks we don't want the minimum and the maximum because they are nominal so there's no there's no level and we we may it's okay not to delete the missing okay um you may also want to click these plots um all of these data or these plots cannot be used because not all except one um because these the data that we have are all nominal level so if we're going to click the bar plot here it will show us actually a bar graph which is very similar to what we did here in excel so just in this just a moment okay so again it will give us the bar plot or the bar graph in in a in a here so already done okay so <clears throat> the good the bad thing is only that the, the the labels are intertwining um one can fix that in in the labeling later on but the thing is you can it, it, you know it's similar it's actually the same with the the one we did here in excel Okay, so you can see here the Coke, the Coke Zero Pepsi. So this is ready to be copied and pasted already. Okay, and you to be used in your document. Again, just don't forget to cite your reference as Jamoji and number one and number two here. Um, if ever you're going to use Jamovi. So again, what the what is the good thing here in Jamovi? It's free. Okay, it's free and it's legit if we're going to use this in our everyday lessons. So it's just one click away in creating this bar graph this frequency distribution and others anyways as i can see the frequency distribution it's lacking the total so maybe we can add here in the data to give us a total value and the frequency i oh, know we cannot do that and the total is just 50. you can see the total 50 here and of course since it's the total is 50 so therefore it's also a hundred percent Okay, so this is it um, for our for our descriptives. As as you can see, you can you can see this, the frequency distribution and the bar graph um, in quite a very short time, in just simple clickings. Okay, so that's it. Um, only that in the in the Jamovi we cannot do the pie chart. There's no option so far of the pie chart, or if there is, so I haven't checked it yet. Okay, but for now, um, it's enough for us to create the bar graph over here. Okay, so that's it for this video. I'm, I'm going to cut this and then I'm going to create another video, another set of exercises for you guys. So thank you very much for watching and I hope that you would like and subscribe. Okay, see ya!